travel recovery? Is it underway? How long will it take? Uh, there's no question that the stock market has recovered significantly. We're up 50% off of our lows. A lot of the big companies are up two, 300%. But I think now we have to earn our growth. So it's going to be a period of time to consolidate around the, the movements that we've made. Um, but I think when we look back 18, 24 months from now, um, generally things are going to be, uh, will have improved, stock prices will be higher, uh, and companies will be better positioned to compete. Vacation rental, a very large market. What brought you to it? Um, you know, we were attracted by the opportunity to create a, a market leader, to create a, a company that was going to give consumers real choice, and we believe that you know, the, the choice element and the consumer shopping experience is going to allow that market to continue to grow and the online penetration to go from you know, the low uh, teens uh, into the 20s and 30 percent over, over time, and that's going to make us a, a big company with a big market. The international markets, big source of growth in online travel. Where are you in that space and what brought you to it? Yeah, Jake, we've invested in uh, India's largest online travel portal, a company called Make My Trip. And uh, that, that one's grown uh, based on the internet market in India and then just uh, consumer spending in India has grown significantly. And thanks to that, Make My Trip's the leading online travel portal there. So we're very excited about international markets. It's still early stages as far as disruptive technologies go. Uh, OTAs just now just taking off. Uh, next to come will be Meta, Search, and then Advisory, just like it has been here. What are the big themes that your fund is investing in? Well, other than cloud computing on the infrastructure side, we do believe there's opportunities in what I call entertainment shopping and applying entertainment shopping to the travel industry. We're also trying to figure out how a virtual goods phenomena, which has emerged, is applying to the travel industry. That's a little bit harder for me to get my head around, although Phil referenced it with Farmville in his opening remarks the other day. Um, but entertainment shopping is this combination of, you know, kind of the old world notion that people like to do window shopping. They like to have fun while they're having this experience of buying something. And, you know, by and large, shopping for travel is not a particularly fun experience. So that's an area that we're looking at is applying those concepts into the travel industry.